How do I shut off water to my bathtub that is leaking from the faucet and into the wall behind the bathtub? There is no access panel, so do I have to tear out the sheet rock to access it? I ignored the trickle leak from the back of the faucet, where it meets the tile, but now have noticed that the wall behind the tub has water damage and mold is growing on the wall, too. Welcome, I will do my best to help with your issue. There usually aren't dedicated shutoffs to a tub valve slash faucet. If you just want to shut the tub off you'll probably have to cut the wall open behind the tub and install a couple shutoffs on the hot and cold water pipes. I was afraid of that. This repair was done by a contractor when I first moved in. He had to tear out the sheet rock and fix some part inside the wall, then put sheet rock back up. Not long after, the same issue of water trickling from the faucet, and apparently into the wall, came back. When he was waiting for a part to come in, but instead repaired the existing one, he did something that left me with the use of water throughout the house. That led me to believe that there is a shut-off valve in the wall. Well you can always open up the wall and find out or look in the basement, if this is on the first floor and you have a basement, below the tub. I live in a remodeled mobile home. It's a 1984 home, and the tub in that bathroom, nor the faucet, was replaced. I have no basement. I have no access under the house as it is enclosed. I have a main water shutoff valve for the whole house outside by the meter. Was not replaced, rather. Then you'll have to shut off the main and cut in a couple shutoffs if you want to kill the water to the tub. I'd rather fix the problem, but can't afford it right now. How difficult is it to cut in my own shutoff valves? Moderately difficult. What type of water piping do you have? Ha ha. I have no idea. I'm a woman, by the way, not that that means I can't handle it, but let's just say I'm not a do-it-yourself-er. I just want to turn the water off until I can afford to have a plumber come out and fix the issue. If I have to tear into the wall, fine, but there's no guarantee I'll find what I'm looking for. Then again, that sheet rock panel is ruined anyway from the water and mold, so it'll have to come out anyway. What part do you suppose is causing the issue? Or do you not have enough information? There is no way I can tell what the problem is from your description. If you can determine what you have for piping it may not be very difficult. There are push lock valves available that just push onto the pipe and lock in place. If you have piping that's compatible with these valves then installing the shutoffs is pretty easy. So if you want to tackle this you need to cut the wall open, expose the piping then see what size and type the piping is. Who knew you may get lucky and find a couple shutoffs buried in the wall. I hope so. I mean I can't figure out how I had use of the whole house's water while waiting for that part to come in. He took a part out to use to order a new part, but refurbished it instead. During that time, over a weekend, I had complete use of the house's water. That leads me to believe there is some way to stop the flow to the tub alone. Sounds like you probably have shutoffs in the wall. But you won't know until you open it up. What would it look like and do I need a screwdriver to turn it off? You should need any tools. It should have either a lever or a circular handle. Okay, thanks. You're welcome. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.